How do you get over a girl? Focus on yourself. Period. No excuses. This is 100% true. It'll hurt at first. But you'll move on over time. Keep your head up and you do you. This. When I was going through a bad breakup a wise man told me to put the energy of loving her into loving yourself. Self love is not just about beating yourself up over past mistakes. But making decisions today that future you would be proud of and. It worked. One year later we started talking again. I had gained 30 pounds and was in the best shape of my life. I had the chance to get back together with her and I chose not to. All of the work I did for myself reinforced that I wasn't the same person and it wasn't meant to be. I couldn't be more proud of my decision. Self. Love heals. Make new rules. Count them. For example. 1. Don't pick up the phone. 2. Don't let her in. 3. Don't be her friend. If you're inside of her you ain't getting over her. 4. Delete her from your social media accounts. Don't even think about searching and checking her out in a few years. Trampoline. This is correct. Time. Boring. But true. It'll take time yes. But you also need to go out and do things you can't just sit in your room and cry. You need to go out and do things that make you happy like hanging out with friends. Going to see a movie. ETC. Can someone answer how do you get over a guy that you liked for a long time but never dated because neither of you would admit how you felt and now he's gone? By learning from your mistakes. And making sure it never happens again. That's why I'm pretty open and upfront these days. Make sure people know your intentions within a few weeks. In all seriousness. Just remove everything that reminds you of her from your life. Unfollow her. Delete photos texts. Try to avoid communication. If you don't want to permanently delete those things yet just move them to a place where you can easily access them. After that just lift heavy weights. Hang with the boys and try to find another girl to get with. And fap. Get under a different girl. Best way to get over someone old is to get under someone new. It's been one. Five years my dude. Every relationship since then has felt bland for me. So I have no idea. Getting towards three years since my ex and I still feel the same as the day I met her. Not sure what to do at this point honestly. Jump. I took this entirely differently. Maybe I'm just dark but I thought you meant jump as in commit suicide. I need to take a break from reddit. You were somebody before you made loving her part of your identity. Just gotta find what you did that made you happy before she came along and made you happy for you. Time heals everything. You never forget and you never get 100% over it but sometime in the future you will go 24 hours without thinking about her and you won't even realize it. And then you will go a week and then eventually a month as life goes on and you will be just fine. I throw myself into video games. Some people throw themselves into work or the gym or some new hobby. Really. Anything that distracts you for even a little while. So long as it's not purposely destructive like drinking drugs or overeating. We'll be good here. Sometimes you don't. I would argue that many never really do. That hole in your psyche is still there. It may be covered up by scar tissue and not hurting anymore but the deep wounds just don't close up. Your existence changes and you just get used to the new normal. Think about their flaws. When you have a crush on someone you tend to ignore all of their flaws. So truly think about who they are and usually you'll realize that you were blinded. Take her off the pedestal you built for her bro deep down she's just like all the other chickens. By improving yourself and building confidence. And dating other girls. It's really that simple. Love yourself first. Then open up to other people. Really soon that girl is in the rear view mirror and you are loving life in the now. Would I be a hypocrite if I gave you advice? When I actually need advice on the same topic. If yes. This will be a no to self. The actual advice. If you are asking this question. She probably doesn't want you. Or she doesn't want you as much as you want her. Right? 
Why would you want to be with someone who doesn't want you as much as you want her? There are plenty of other women out there. Who would love you? Just wait for the right one. Sometimes the end of a relationship is like the death of a loved one. Sometimes you don't get over it. Sometimes you just soldier on. And sometimes your mind has to bury them to be free again. Had to do this a few times myself. Hang out with friends. Start talking to other girls. Focus on her shortcomings. When we really like someone. We often put them on a pedestal and only see the positives. By looking at their negatives. It can help us to see that they are not perfect after all. Step 1. Take some time to wallow in it. Don't try to get over it instantly. It's okay to feel terrible for a bit. Step 2. Pull yourself together and arrange some closure. Become fully functional. Fake it to whatever level you need to. Get closure one way or another. Burn all your mementos of them one by one if that's what works for you. Step 3. Get back out there. Even though you don't want to. Flirt with someone. Go on some dates and do not talk about your ex. Or allow yourself to think about them. Focus on this person and what's good and or bad about them. Step 4. Make the conscious effort to open yourself up emotionally to a new person. Find another one. I've been married three times. Each time. I knew this was the one. First two times. I was way wrong. You just move on. Find your way. When it's time. It's time. Fuck. Three times? Man I do not want to get divorced again. Block her number. Social media. Delete the photos. Cut contact. Hit the gym and focus on your friends and hobbies. It'll still hurt. Acknowledge that in process but it's way faster this way. I know this seems obvious. But stop thinking about her. Think about other things. And when you catch yourself thinking about her. Just tell yourself no and force yourself to think about something else. Douche tea that'll take your mind off of her. Minimalize free time so you don't think about her. The less she's on your mind. The easier it is to get over it. I go on and off with feelings for this girl. I find that not texting her. Making an effort to keep her text thread buried on my phone. And not checking her social media. To be the best way. Out of sight. Out of mind. Stop saying those things. Doing those things. And going to those places. Which you know might hurt you. Good friend of mine told me that shortly after my divorce years ago. Some of the best advice I've ever heard. As a bisexual girl. I think I can contribute some of my own knowledge from experience. Always keep your mind occupied. If you just sit around and mope. Said girl will be the only thing on your mind. And that sucks. Go out on walks. Call or visit friends. Find a new hobby. Keep yourself busy. So then you have enough time to move on before you even think about her again. Focus on you. Start working out and hanging out with people. When I did those things it took my mind off of the girl and opened my eyes to literally everything. So much out there to get wrapped up over one person. Don't look at her Facebook. Instagram. Snap etc. Delete old photos of with her and spend time with your friends. Cry if you want. It helps. Try to see the good in her. No matter why it ended. That way you never have to think god that was a huge mistake. What's wrong with me? But don't downplay the negatives that cause the breakup either. That way you develop an honest opinion about her. And reach out to people. New and old alike. Fill the hole that she's left behind in your life. Do the whole workout. Focus on your job thing. Sure. But legitimately. That's not what you miss. Doing things out of spite just breeds malcontent. And I guess. Falling in love is fun. You get the chance to do that again. My opinion is that only time and space allow you the breathing room to heal. At least for the immediate future. I've also found that watching movies and TV shows that deal with heartbreak help me relate to humanity as a whole and remind me that pain is part of the human experience. 
Some recommendations. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind Her I personally have some episodes of How I Met Your Mother that I used to watch. There are more but I got asleep. Will update when I think of some. Good luck. Fellow human. You will come out of this a more well-rounded and mature person. Give yourself time. Don't rush into anything. Allow your sadness. Anger. Frustration of the breakup to be expressed in a safe way and accept that it's over. After that. Realize that you are awesome and that you have a lot to offer. To yourself and to someone else. If 1 in 10 people want to go out with you you are now one step closer. You got it champ. One step at a time. Damn if 1 in 10 people wanted to go out with you your pretty popular wishful thinking makes me think 1 in a 1000. Focus on yourself. Better yourself. Prove that you don't need her in order to be a great man. Work out. Hang with friends. Get that cash. Focus on being successful. You'll soon realize that she was probably holding you back. Keep your heads up King Tsar. You can never actually get over someone until you put yourself in a better situation and you find someone to move on to. Simple math. Half the population of this planet. Nearly 4 billion people. Are female. There's a lot of them. And every year. They make a new batch. Move on. There will be another one. And maybe several other ones. That's the math of the situation. My friend. You just do. Like everything else you have to accept the harsh reality. If whatever the relationship was ended and they don't want contact with you then it over. The best way to help get over it would be to surround yourself with the ones and things you love but no matter how much you distract yourself. At the end of the day you have to accept and move on with your life. Think about every shti she said or did to you. Your family and friends. It helps to see how shitty she was and you deserve better. Realize they are far beyond me early and reject the idea of being in a relationship when meeting new girls to save as much heartbreak as possible. Of course the downside is a constant stream of loneliness and hurting in your chest but it's much better than having serve as depression every rejection. Give yourself time to embrace the fact that you two won't be together anymore. Don't get a rebound and in time you will be okay with being temporarily alone. Get rid of everything that reminds you of her. Block on socials. Delete number. Delete photos. Donate things that she left or she bought for you. Etc. Then start doing things you love. Keep yourself busy and find good people. There is no easy way. Getting either someone is TG easiest part actually but you need to get through it in order to get either it. See Tage one day at a time and work through the memories the hurt it carries and cried out scream if you have to and then you'll know when you've reached the point of getting over her. All the best for you and remember God knows your heart and he will heal it. Start with a ladder. Climb up it. I'd say about an 8 foot ladder. You're going to want to stand on the top of it. Which isn't safe but you have a goal here. Then jump. You'll probably hurt yourself. You'll probably hurt said girl. But chances are, you'll get over her in the process. Time. You also have to move on and start building up your life. Don't dwell in the shattered remains of the past relationship. Also surround yourself with your loved ones. Good to be reminded folks care. It hurt for several years. But the pain fades. Like others have said here. Focus on you. Enjoy the freedom and the lack of commitments. I found my solace in nature and disc golf. Go back to dating only when you are ready. I spent 10 years single and I learned a lot about myself. Turns out I am not a bad cook. Make a list of must haves and can't stands. Chances are. She will have more than a few in the latter category. Also helps moving forward in dating. Fill your schedule with lots of fun stuff with friends. When you do have free time make it productive or do something you like. But spending a lot of time with friends or family is best. Wait it out. Eventually either you'll stop to see whatever you saw in her that attracted you or you'll meet someone new who makes you forget about the last one. Carry forward all the lessons. All the good. All the beauty and love. Let go of the mistakes. 
Find strength in being alone. But seldom lonely. Pour all the good into yourself and the next woman. Keep building upon the good. Find a porno starring a girl that looks just like the girl that broke your heart. Watch it. Put play the cast for kids song in the background. Associate her with something horrible. 1. No contact 2. Work on yourself. Journal. Meditate. Lift. Eat right. Spend time with friends. Become good at things. Pursue your passions 3. Wait 2 to 3 months. Then go out with another girl. But don't rush into a relationship. Get busy. I've started learning languages. Writing. Listening to podcasts. Just generally doing things I didn't do with her. And I've realized there's a whole world of stuff out there. I can't just sit around moping so we have to know what I'm missing. I have to do things for myself. By myself that make me happy. It's her loss that she can't experience it with me. Hang in there until one day you will find someone new. It doesn't even need to happen anything with a new girl but it should be enough to make you focus on the future. You're eventually going to need to move on. What sucks most is hearing people say. Just give it time. That heals all wounds. And it hurts the most. That's when you can be sure it applies most to your situation too. Don't. 1. Visit her social media profiles. Like ever. Better yet just block her BTCHS everywhere. 2. Definitely have more sx with girls. That does help a lot. 3. Don't text or call her. And don't pick up the fun if she contacts you or whatever. Hope that helps. Focus on what you're doing. I was in the middle of football so I focused on that in school. Look straight ahead and don't look back. Focus on herself. Give yourself some time to heal. For me alcohol is always my go to. Get rid of everything that reminds you of her. Block her number in social media. After the numbness starts to fade away pick yourself up and go out and look for someone else. Friends are also always best to have around too. Block from all social media. Including her friends that might post pictures of her. Focus on yourself. Grow. And remember. When you miss her the most. You might not want her. But the good feeling of being close to another person. You'll get over her and find someone better for you.